Ho, ho, ho. Merry Christmas. It's me, Father Claus. Or Santa Claus, either one, I don't really care. Speaking of Claus, I uh, broke the clause in my contract stating that I can't mess with the Christmas present budget. Yep. Went to Las Vegas. Put all the budget on red. Guess which colour it was. That's right. Not red. So now Santa's got to make GeoGuessr videos and hope that Santa goes viral and Santa can pay off his immense debt. Santa would have played Warzone, but uh, Santa doesn't have a powerful PC. If only Santa asked for one for Christmas. Oh wait, that's not possible, is it? Because I can't treat myself. Okay, let's get straight into this. This is gonna be the most fun time I've ever had. First round, what do we have? Okay, it's very blurry, but we're back. We are so back. Oh yeah, I remember this place. This is America, right? Good old Denver. Actually, no, I hated Denver, that's right. They gave me a speeding ticket here, didn't they? Yep, it wasn't even my fault. I told Rudolph to calm down, he just wouldn't listen. So it was deducted out of his wages, and rightly so. I don't even know how they caught me on camera. I don't even have a registration plate. You'd be surprised, I actually fairly remember this, considering I was about 2 million whiskeys deep at the time. To the average person, that would completely finish them off, but when you've been alive for like 500,000 years, it's light work. But yeah, let me tell you, tower blocks are not fun, especially when the elevators don't work, like this one. As you can see, it was uh, easier to just roll down the stairs rather than walk, you know? That was like the boulder out of Indiana Jones. It was quite entertaining, I imagine, for the residents. It's probably just some really small square. I mean, it looks like there's a bus stop right here. Unless it's like boulder area, which I did actually go to university there at one point. Yeah, I know, pretty shocking. Quickly left, though, my roommate stole my mattress and I never got over it. This road right here. Let's see how we do. Let's see. Whew, nearly 5,000 points. Whereabouts was it? This little square here. That is tiny. How the hell was I meant to find that? I don't think I had a chance. Second round we go on to. What have we got? Another Christmas market. Great to see. It's kind of lacking though, if I'm honest. There's not too much here. Do I recognise this place? Not too sure. It kind of looks like a warm area. Maybe somewhere like Mexico, somewhere like that, which let me tell you, great alcoholic beverages. Never done so many tequilas in my life. I remember that year in 2014 when it was just tequila after tequila in Mexico. That was the second most amount of tequilas I've ever had in one night. Uh, the first being Las Vegas, of course. That didn't end too well. What? Okay, I think I see Euros over there, so never mind. It's not Mexico. It's probably Spain or somewhere. Wait, tourism? The Corbo Cordoba Corboba Tourism in the city of Cordoba. Oh wait, it's right here. Here we go. Okay, thank God I didn't go for Madrid because it certainly wasn't that. Oh, I see a statue right here. Is this it? Hold on, let me see the road layout for a second. Is this pharmacia right there? And there's a pharmacia right here. Let's give it a go. Let's see what we get. Please be five thousand points. It's not. It's not far though. Three points off. It was. A random park that I probably would have never seen. I, I actually don't remember ever going to this place, which is uh, quite concerning. Maybe that's why I've got so many one-star reviews on Yelp. Would make sense. Could get a like 24,900 point game. It's doable, if my maths is correct anyway. I'm not too sure. I never went to school. From a young age, I was riding the sleigh. Third round we go on to. And another great Christmas market. Or is it actually? Hold on, I recognise this place. Yeah, I know this place. This is in Switzerland. I got a parking fine here once. House I was trying to park on was very slanted. I parked on the road. There was a double yellow. They clamped Rudolph. I don't know why Rudolph always gets the punishments. It makes no sense. Maybe I should have listened to all those other reindeers when they were calling them names. Maybe there was a good reason for that. Probably the most expensive Christmas market you'll ever go to. You probably have to remortgage just for a hot chocolate, you know. But it's Switzerland. It's a beautiful country. Oh, God, I just realize I'm really deflating aren't I? Looks like that keto diet works really fast. I only signed up for it yesterday. Wait, hold on. Basil! I've heard of Basil, my uh, football team that I support, Chelsea. Yeah, that's right, Santa Claus is a big fan of Didier John, but get used to it. Played against Basil, and I went there. Basil, Basil, Basil. Oh, here it is, right here. Okay. Oh, my beard's coming off. That can't be happening. Santa doesn't have a jawline. <laughs> Gonna have to go for a random street in Basel. I mean, it's a very small city, so it should be 5,000 points. Our streak should continue of not getting 5,000 points, but very close to 5,000 points. Let's just say that. Whew. 
Oh my god, why couldn't you just round it up? Are you serious? Considering that's the closest we got, I think it's uh, time to celebrate with a shot of vodka. Just kidding, it's water. Uh, Santa attends his AA meetings. Every single one of them. I'm trying to get 100% so I can go on the uh, four-part trip at the end of the year. Despite the aim of this video is to pay off my immense debt, I'm having a great time. I thought I said London for a sec. I was going to say, this is definitely a lot London, but considering there's two A's next to each other, which is very unnecessary, I'm going to guess it's the Netherlands once again. Have we had the Netherlands? Actually, I don't think we had the Netherlands, did we? Uh... I have no clue. Oh, wait, I just realised I'm an idiot. I can move around on this one. Oh, this makes it ten times easier. I ain't no no moving challenge. I'm moving around as much as I want. When I get freedom, I embrace it. I recognise these houses. That's the thing. If I remember correctly, they didn't have a chimney, so I had to use the cat flap. <laughs> was a tough squeeze. I will find this Gorinchum that they speak of. And let me tell you, when I do find it, I will be guessing so hard. <gasps> it's right here. I found it. It's this tiny town that no one would ever expect it to be. Actually, I can't be asked for that. I'm just going to guess a random location. Let's go for there. If the map loads in. I spent way too long trying to find this. Let's see how we do. 4,996. Once again, under a kilometre. I'm just happy we found the town because what the hell was that? Random place in the middle of nowhere. Okay, final round. Let's do this. Final round of the first game, matter of fact. We're going back to back, so be sure to stay tuned. Hey, it's me. A really bad version of me. Since when did I have the red nose? That's Rudolph's thing. Also, one more thing about this whole Coca-Cola thing. Don't believe it. They haven't sponsored me once. There's a heavy lawsuit coming their way. Trust me, and I will be eating good. Ooh, Jacka something something okay i'm guessing this is eastern europe kind of looks like hungary or something if i'm honest vienna it says right there on this massive building thank you very much unless it's not vienna and they've just tricked me but surely they wouldn't do that to santa you know oh crap no that's the worst one so far it was bosnia when do you ever get bosnia on geo guesser of course we ended with a terrible guess that's really ruined the game I should have taken my time. Do you know that I think about it? The language wasn't even Austrian at all, was it? 23,000 isn't too bad. But I know we can do better. Let's just say that. Second game, we go on to. And what do we see? A pretty impressive statue. Don't know how the top half is floating like that. That really is impressive. I'll tell you what. Back in the day, they could really make a statue, couldn't they? I remember those days. Gone downhill since then. All went downhill when those three pound meal deals in England went to like four pounds. Which was only like last year, but it's really annoyed me. That's why I don't stop off in the UK now. Not just because of that at all, but you know, going into London now and I've got to pay a ULES fee. My vehicle is the most eco-friendly thing on the planet. It doesn't even use diesel. It's just Rudolph and that. They just crack a Red Bull and get on with it. But this actually does look like the Netherlands. And we had problems with the Netherlands last time. But that's not going to happen again. None of those flags look like the Netherlands, but you can't tell me this building doesn't look like the Netherlands. That is a straight up Netherlandish building. And it's not being Amsterdam. Let's be real. This looks like a city centre or somewhere. Not a lot I can read unfortunately. Uh, Santa doesn't have the greatest of vision. Found that out the hard way. Let me just say, I'll ignore the Alps next time. Never go near those mountains again. That was one hell of a concussion. I feel like I'm too far out of the city centre. That's the problem. What about Harlem? Oh, this actually looks quite good. There's a centre right here. But yeah, let's go for this one. Gothic style and Mozart's organ. Shouldn't it be in his body? It seems good enough for me. Let's go for it. God damn it. It was Antwerp. This isn't even the same country. Thankfully though, both countries are incredibly small. So I've still got 4,400 points. Second round we go on to. What do we get? Another Christmas market. That doesn't look like it's got a lot going on to be honest. Uh, there's a few cabins. Uh, not very Christmassy stuff. They're just selling backpacks. You can get that out of duty free. Even I know that. And I don't even take planes. Well actually I did one year when I... Uh, Lost my slaying license. I've learned. I've moved on. You know, it's not the same me. Judging by this poster right here, I'm gonna guess this is Poland or somewhere. It gives off very Polish vibes, or maybe even Hungary actually. I think. I think I should go for Poland. I think it would make more sense. The only thing I'm thinking about is Poland's signs are normally in green. Maybe Czech Republic has white. Let's go for Prague. Let's see what that's like. There's a Prague too? How did I not know about this? Yeah, I'm going for Prague. I am pretty certain it's going to be this location. Watch. 5,000 points. Here we go. 
4,000. Okay, which city was this? Actually, which town was this? Olemuak. I think it's taught. We'll have to remember that one because I now have beef with them. Any location that I get wrong is no friend of mine. Third round. Let's see what we get. Oh, it's kind of gloomy looking. Can't see a whole lot. And the Christmas market kind of looks like it's lacking. Where's all the lights at? Hold on a second. San Marino? I mean... Isn't San Marino quite hilly? Never really need to spend that much time here, but we could be onto a 5,000 points, maybe. There's a little square right here. Maybe it's this place. Nope. I don't see any, like, city squares. That's the only problem. Oh, here we go. Northwest facing. I mean, I don't know. Either way, country's very small, so I'm most likely getting 5,000 points. Let's give it a shot. Okay, never mind. It wasn't San Marino. They lied. Another town that I don't remember. Piacenza or something? I'm ashamed of my skill nowadays. I don't even want people to see my face anymore. They all kind of let the same these Christmas markets, don't they? All got log cabins and a KFC that's 60 meters away. That is good to know. I like KFC. They're nice to me normally. They give me an extra drumstick sometimes and I really do appreciate that. They respect us essential employees, you know, and that's how it should be. Okay, I see a .cz domain. So there's only one place and one place only that this could be. I'm going to go for the town of Humperlec and I'm very certain that this is going to be 5,000 points. Let's see. God damn it, where was it? It was Ostrava. It wasn't a random town. It was like the second largest city in the Czech Republic. Okay, this one is looking much greater. They saved the best till last because this is an insane Christmas market that unfortunately doesn't show a whole lot. It says little trick right there and that's about it. Oh, there's a language here. That looks like Greek. Is this a Greek Christmas market? Certainly what it feels like. Let's go for Athens then because that's the only city I actually really know in Greece to be honest. It's kind of bad, I know. Oh my God, it's right there. Holy crap, I was just hovering above it. This is insane. What the hell was the chances of that? Is it down this little small road here? Which way are we facing? We're facing south. If there's more than one little trick, I am going to be livid. I guess that's kind of facing southeast, so it makes sense. Let's give it a go. 5,000 points. We got 5,000 points on the very last guess. What's the chances of that? That is a great way to end it. That guess has just made my day, I'll tell you that. 21,409 points. I mean, it's not as good as the previous round, but it will do. Remember, I'm not a GeoGuessr Pro. I've only been to every single house on the planet. But yeah, thank you for watching today's video. Please make sure to like the video because I actually just forgot that the main reason of this video is so that I can pay off my debt. So liking the video would help massively. But yeah, hope you all have a great Christmas. I mean, you're not getting any presents because... Wasn't my luck at the casino. But yeah, thank you for watching and I think I'm near go get kebab now. Peace. These nuts.